Namaste Leo. Welcome to my channel. This is Lasha Magical. Um, welcome in. Make yourself comfortable and enjoy the show first of all because that is really what everything is about in here. Um, this is going to be your general reading for the month of July. We are having a look today into some forecasts for your sun moon rising and Venus placements of a lovely sign of a Leo. Um, doing some energy check in. Uh, this is a general one, okay? So please keep that in mind that this may or may not resonate with you. Take only what does resonate with you, okay? If it's not your message, then it is definitely for somebody else. Uh, if you are new in here, I hope pretty much that you are coming in here to stay any case thank you very much for tuning in checking out the channel and the reading for you uh, and if you are coming back thank you very very much leos uh, for doing so because it truly really means a lot for the channel to grow uh, yeah that's that's great support so thank you for that um even though I'm reading for July, whenever you come across this reading, the time is right for you, okay, for messages to be found for you, uh, so you can resonate with them. If you find yourself that you resonate with this reading, which is great, there is also an extended version of more messages that you need to know, Leo. Uh, also, if you are interested in some oracle messages, you will find that into extended. In this one, I'm having a general look into four messages for your sign and I will be clarifying those as I usually do so you get a little more deeper picture of you know what's really going on in here for you and if you find yourself Leo that you don't resonate with this reading that's okay maybe you should check your previous readings if you have not already of course or you should definitely have a look into your other placements because you know your messages might be there for you to get a full picture so leo sun rising and venus let's see how july energies play out for you here you are so let's see what do you need to know what do you need to hear right here right now i'm very very grateful to be able to do these readings I quite enjoy this and I really hope you do it as well. And if you do, I will kindly please that you like, share and subscribe so we can grow even more. Support is always welcome and always appreciated. So let's see what this is about for a lot of you as an overall energy. We have the Hierophant. This is Taurus, Virgo, Major, Arcana, number of five. So uh, for a lot of you, you are experiencing some quite shocking, maybe a little, a little bit dramatic change. Uh, because in the numerology, five always uh, determines change. It's like a door opener for a change to come in but but you know it's it's like you did not expect this so it's like you know it can be shocking for a lot of you um definitely something for your growth this change is very welcome uh, maybe for a lot of you, you actually uh, manifested this change and for a lot of you, you maybe have experienced it, uh, this energy already um, this is about spiritual journey. This is about growth. This is about your spiritual path. You walking towards enlightenment and awakening. So I feel like you are going through a lot. And for a lot of you, the message that we have underneath that is the Ace of Cups. So this actually is challenging because it actually points to self-love, self-nurturing, self-care with the Ace of Cups, Water Elements Energy, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Ace 
and underneath that is the sun yeah it's almost like you you were wishing you were manifesting working towards you know i'm ready to step into that energy to open that door and i feel like now at this period of time it's happening for you i feel like this actually has to do all with divine timing that you needed to lose yourself to find yourself back again leo you know your path towards your own happiness your your lucky energy this is your major arcana by the way and you know having the clarity about what it is that i want what it is that i need so fulfilling your own cup by yourself is the greatest thing you can actually do because this is bringing you forward it's it's moving you forward to your spiritual growth and your spiritual path which is you know this is great start this is great start to be honest so when it comes to your messages as the first one we have page of pentacles this is it this is the beginning and creating of stability of something stable you know for every single one of you it will be something different this may be something in general you know like stability in general or this may be something very specific like a specific area of your life that it's it's almost like that feeling of new door actually opening for you this is um earth energy virgo taurus capricorn and this is yeah i feel like new beginning for a lot of you creation of something stable whether this is your business whether this is your path career whether this is you know connections in your family life in your surroundings in your you know something personal but i feel growth definitely with your overall energy as Hierophant, and then you know opening message for you leo page of pentacles uh, this is great i feel like the time has come for you to open that new door of new beginning new creation that is that change it has to do with your stability so for a lot of you i feel july will be actually pretty much surprising and you know even though you have manifested once it happens it will actually feel surprising that's why maybe you know with the five that drastic kind of a shocking change uh, i was picking up a little bit dramatic but of course this is not uh, going to be for every single one of you so yeah lovely lovely start i must tell for a lot of you this this has to do with uh, you know relocating moving out moving in you know changing location changing environment and surroundings moving out moving in like you know moving out to create your new stability totally or moving in to create it with somebody next to that we have eight of cups water elements energy cancer pisces scorpio i feel like a lot of you you are connected with a water sign and you know this is literally the message of manifestation manifestation for my wishes to come true i want to walk and go towards my happiness towards the sun this is your wish fulfillment this is actually you you want to have clarity the time has come you will have it definitely we saw the sun already and one of your manifestation if not the biggest one is the ten of cups whether this is with this water sign with this person who may not even be a water sign but they just find themselves maybe in their watery energy that can be possible but with the ten of cups we also have that water energy maybe for a lot of you you have some water elements prominent in your chart that can also be possible but this is that wish fulfillment that is that happiness i want to have marriage i want to have a committed relationship i want to have something that is secure something that is stable i want to have somebody by my side i want to have somebody to you know when i come home to look at me and smile at me and you know maybe ask how your day was or you know you want that and that is main thing that you have been manifesting and it's here it's here for you leo and this is a part of your spiritual path so this is definitely a soulmate connection 
and by the end of your spread we have page one so you start with the page and you end with the page which tells me a lot of new energies coming your way a lot of new doors actually opening you know with the page of pentacles as i was saying when it comes to your security when it comes to your finances when it comes to your business when it comes to your stability in general whether this is for you you know emotional stability financial or mental but maybe even all at once and with the page of wands this is passionate new start this is passionate new start yeah very creative within so let's clarify for you leo and see a little bit deeper what this is actually about for you if you wish a personal reading with me leo definitely check the description box because all the informations are written in there okay and when it comes to extended um you will get the link also shared in there so you can follow it and watch it <clears throat> so let's see page of pentacles wow this is deep we have leadership at the bottom of the deck and we have the dream actually coming through as clarification this was def this is this was something that you have manifested i feel like you have waited so long for a cycle to you know be finished i was doing your readings leo um i was feeling it with you guys all the way along and i feel like you waited for the cycle to you know pass you by to um get over with that for for you to experience that new beginning it's almost like new chances are given and this time you will take it like appropriate because you've grown you've grown this is your overall energy it's like you've grown you you level up yourself leo and you're walking that path of your journey, of your spiritual journey. I mean, all of us, we are on our spiritual journey. This is the dream come true. It's almost like your stability will show in maybe other ways than you have expected. Lovely. I gotta show you one more time this is lovely and you know with the leadership it's like yes i leveled up i'm taking the leap of faith and moving on i i do not like to say i'm having control over my life because it's life it's like so unpredictable like no there's no need to talk about control on that subject called life but you know with leadership it's like yeah baby i got this i'm i'm rolling on i'm on the road now i have learned underneath that is yeah past life cycle has been closed you closed off karmic depths and now you are ready leadership now you are ready for your dreams to come true i'm getting goosebumps all over my body yeah this is beautiful leo beautiful so let's see eight of cups let's see about eight of cups possibilities okay for a lot of you you will have these are possibilities of the new door that i you know have mentioned and we have braveness at the bottom of the deck so i feel like you were stepping into that braveness into that courage because now you are in harmony this is the message right underneath leo 
you are in harmony. You have saw it beyond the illusion. It's almost like I cut the shit out. You know, situations, energies, people, um, ego trips of myself. Like I cut all the illusions and I moved on and I stepped into the harmony. So now I'm even braver than before. I got that courage that will bring me to the eight of cups because I'm following, I'm following those steps and the universe knows my wishes, my desires, my hopes because it's there, it's that burning, burning, like yes. And possibilities are opening, you know, in your business, in your environments for your highest good in your relationships, whatever kinds of relationship those are. But every possible possibility is ready here to find you, Leo, because now you are ready. Now you are brave and have enough of courage to take, you know, all of these big energies coming your way. And you know, next to it is the Ten of Cups and that is big. Let me tell you, that is big. That is like emotional fulfillment. So lucky and joyful energy. Somebody's coming to approach you to give you that offer. Yeah. You definitely have closed the cycle of karmic debts when it comes to, you know, your own spiritual journey. So you pay that. You've been through what you need to go through. And now you are ready. You have released the past energy. That's why the Ten of Cups is now here to enter your life, Leo. For you to have total satisfaction. Last piece of a puzzle. This may be, in this case, this may be a person. This may be information. This may be situation or even just some type of energy that is coming to you and maybe through you to, you know, uh, lead you into unity of the Ten of Cups. That marriage and high level of commitment, wherever you may be standing, you know, if you're single, you may get to know somebody who may turn out to be the one. If you were, you know, already in a relationship, as I was sensing uh, for some of you, maybe even a water sign for some of you, Cancer Pisces Scorpio, um, and you know, you just stay, maybe you decide to, you know, suddenly move in together, and maybe you get the ring, which, you know, signifies, yeah, you have released the past, like it's done. That's why now is coming to you. Your manifestation is coming to you. Because you close the cycle, being stuck in the past, no more, Biatch. No more, you leveled up, Leo. And this is exactly what you need to have the whole picture, to see it clearly, you know, with the sun, with the Eight of Cups as well. To see it clearly that this is happening for you. This is beautiful reading. Like, I love it. I might just call this reading, wow. <laughs> yeah, like wow, only wow. So let's see, page of wands, clarify with rebel. And we have seeing beyond the illusion again, underneath the deck. So this definitely is happening for you, or will in the near future, maybe by mid-July, um, there is also something that will also be an eye-opener for you. You know, your intuition is coming through with this message. 
seeing beyond the illusion. And with the rebel as the clarification for the page of wands, um, it's almost like that creation is going to set you free. Whether this is business, whether this is personal. It can be something simple, you know. Um, whatever this may be for you, and again, it's going to be different for every single one of you. It's setting you free. You're breaking from those chains. It's giving you freedom. That's why look at the girl illustrate. She's like totally free. She's like totally free. Um, in vitality, moving free spiritly. Uh, you know, rebel is also pretty much of a free spirit because it's an Aquarian energy. Uh, It's like, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm wiser now. I learned stuff and I'm ready. Yeah, I feel like that's it with the page of wands and the rebel combination. It's almost like I'm ready. I'm ready to set myself free, to set my goals on fire and just move in that direction for sure. So this is what I have for you. Lovely Leos, thank you very much for all of your support, for your watching. Um, get to share the video, like it if you feel like doing it. I'm truly thankful for that. Get to subscribe. Um, that will be great. I will be more than happy to have you in the community and family that we are creating in here. You are very welcome in the space of the Shuma Magical. So if you are interested in some more messages of tarot and combination with some oracle messages that I have for you, um, join in and I will catch you guys there. Uh, get to enjoy your day, evening, morning, wherever you are in this world. <sighs> Keep it cool. Keep it cool, Lilo. Take care.